Oregon. We're in Dallas. Good morning, everybody. So we are in Dallas. Isn't that amazing? And I'm so excited to be here for Meredith's wedding. Are you happy? Yes. We're both happy. We're kind of pooped. I'm really surprised how difficult the travel was. But it was worth it. Definitely. And we are here. We had plans to like go out and do stuff, the four of us, but Janice and I are not leaving the hotel until the wedding. We are yes. letting our bodies recover and the guys are out having fun. Wonder what they will get up to. Yes. And it's perfectly fine to be on vacation and just let your body recover. Yeah. Me and Paula, even when we go on vacation, we just love spending time in the hotel and enjoying it, soaking it up. You but now know. you get to enjoy it with me. <laughs> yeah, that too. I love it. Enjoying it with my BFF. And plus, we all know Judd and Paul have a bromance, so they're out enjoying Dallas. They were probably secretly happy when we were like, we don't feel well enough to go with y'all. Yeah. Like, they're boys like, day. They're like, <laughs> let's go be stupid silly, so. And plus, we got a really nice car rental, so. The they're, car? Okay. They're car guys, so the they're. The seat in the, the, it's two captain's chairs in the back. They are heated. Though even the ones that I'm in the back, like our seats, they're heated. And then their front seats are cold heated? No, cold Oh, they have seated? cold. You can cool the front seats. Oh my God. They were like messing around with that this uh, yesterday. They are like, yes, this is amazing. No, I would never touch it. But there is a dilemma in our hotel rooms. We did ask for ADA rooms. Because oh like, I, Not we happening. need shower chairs or benches to take a shower and they didn't have any available last night so we weren't able to shower and then also we at required uh fridges for our we've medical been, equipment we even upgraded our rooms to make sure it had everything we needed and there was no mini fridge in here and the hotel was really nice about it They're like we're so sorry we'll fix they were it. nice to them then paul decided to go talk to you um, the manager, nice oh, apparently Paul, not to you Paul. You always have issues like that, though. Well, Paul went down there nicely, and then they're like, well, it's not in your reservation. Um, you know, they still were nice. They gave him free breakfast and then comped our they're room last us, night. And the boys saw the room we're going I to. think, honestly, what they decided to move the room was Paul looked at our reservation online on his phone, and he said, ADA room and he's just like he went down there this morning was like do not tell me I'm a liar because last night they were like well it doesn't say it on your reservation sir and he's like this uh, morning was like ha we don't really know what's happening yeah the guys were down there sorting it and the end of the story is we're moving rooms we're moving to a the guy said an apartment room. <laughs> I was like, and Janice was like, is it in the hotel? <laughs> yeah, that's how they said. They were like, we're moving to an apartment. So I thought it was like Air A Airbnb. No. That's what I thought. <laughs> we're moving. I'm yeah. interested to see where we're moving. Yeah. They're, they're bringing up someone to help us move our luggage now. <laughs> the guys are out having fun in Dallas, and I'm just like. So we get to sort so this get, on our we end get now. To move the room. <laughs> yeah. We just got to our new room. It's pretty big. I'm shocked that they got this for us. Oh my gosh, let's give y'all a tour. So you come in, there's a closet. You go straight, and there's one bedroom. Oh, Ryan's leading the tour. <laughs> Bathroom. Unfortunately, this smells like cigarette smoke. My lungs can, can attest to that. <laughs> and a bedroom. And then you come back out. And they've got this huge living room and a dining room. <laughs> we took the pillows from our old rooms because we like pillows. And a kitchen. <coughs> and another bedroom with a mirror sure and gorgeous. another bathroom with the shower we need to shower safely. Yeah, we have two that country. Oh. This one? Oh, the other one. Okay. <laughs> this one. Oh, hello everyone. Welcome to our home. This is like Welcome cribs. Welcome to my crib. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> Welcome to my crib. <laughs> Welcome
So this is a true test. If I can truly live with Jackie. Dun dun dun. Can I do it? Can I not? What do you guys think? What are you talking about? I stayed with you for two weeks. One oh, that's a good point. So this hasn't, this is nothing. This is really nothing. And those two weeks, she drove me insane. Insane, the membrane. <laughs> It wasn't that bad. I loved her. And then when she left, I was like, I miss my Jackie. Yeah, because we like just chilling with each other. Yes. That's what we're doing now. And the dogs are like really happy with all the space. They're running yeah, laps. Yeah, they are running laps. Now, once we move this <coughs> luggage, I think we're going to go even more crazy. Yeah. I am so excited to be going to Meredith's wedding today. But since this is a wedding and it's a very intimate gathering, we will not be vlogging for this event. But I will definitely have pictures at the end of this vlog. So check it out and stay tuned for that. So there are some questions you guys are asking that I forgot to address. So let's address them. So one of them is, what is Orion eating? Now we have been planning this trip for six months. And of course, six months ago, I think I was doing pretty decent and if so even a long time ago I had in my mind that the next trip I do take Orion is going to be on raw because I wanted to do a beautiful video and show you guys how easy it is to travel with raw well since my health isn't doing the best I wasn't gonna try to do that but I did call the airlines Southwest and confirmed with them how can I take my dog's food with me since he's on a raw diet and all they told me was that the frozen food has to be completely frozen and the ice packs that I take has to be completely frozen as well and I am set and good since my health isn't doing the best and Paul is already taking on so much I decided to just bring his dehydrated food now I know you guys were also asking what are you gonna do about your ears and the airplane ride and I saw that you guys were giving me advice about Hey, chew gum. Well, thank you guys so much for the chewing gum idea, but chewing gum does not work for me because when I do fly, it just, it is very painful. It's like having another ear infection. It's just agonizing. And so now that I tried it again, I'm a little um scared to go back on a plane so it's just imagine just having to deal every time you go on an airplane just knowing you're gonna have an ear infection sensations something that you guys don't know about me I love to travel I want to travel that's something I want to do with Paul but I gotta you know get over that pain and then also got to get over these chronic illnesses as well so who knows we'll see what I do in the future if I get cured so obviously me and Judd have some time to kill here, so while we're getting ready, we're watching Star Wars! Damn yeah, right. Sounds good, Judd? Oh, Alright, Hippo, do you agree? She says yes. Also, uh, Orion agrees as well. Babe, you look beautiful. Very nice dress. And now, time to do her makeup. So, um, you know, as most women have and do. They have a bag full of their makeup. Yes. Me? I just look good naturally. Look at that. Oh yeah. Look at that. See like that. We're getting ready for the wedding. Let's do this. Lots of fun okay. and everything. Babe. And me and Jackie have plenty of time to rest and take it easy so. Yeah. Me and Judd went exploring Dallas. Yeah. Babe you look beautiful. Thank you so much. Orion, he's ready. Look, he got a tuxedo and everything. Orion, you look handsome. Good boy. Janice is here. She looks absolutely gorgeous. Getting her makeup on point. Orion, do you need to do your makeup? He says no. But he has a tuxedo. Look at that. This is the first time I've seen Orion. Look at you. He's like, oh, I know. You are so oh, I know. <laughs> Doing your part for the wedding. Of course. He has a little, doesn't he have a, whatchamacallit, a, the flower, what's it called? Uh, he's the ring bearer. He's the ring bearer. We are 
are ready for the wedding. And if we have pictures, we will share them with you all. But so are the pooches. We got to go. So with that, we'll say goodnight. And thanks for joining us on our adventure. Yes. Adieu and good night.